I wanted to talk this vlog a little bit about kiddos speech and language development and I know we've talked about this a lot lately um, you know I I've made several vlogs about you know just therapy updates and speech updates but we have recently well not really recently like the beginning of the school year so it's been a few months now but we brought back Kidel's um, speaking device he initially started off with his speaking device um, early, in the earlier on years and he would pull pictures from the PEX app to communicate and then he started talking and pretty much everything that he, was in his speaking device he would say verbally so we kind of it phased out like we just kind of quit using it um, he preferred to ask for stuff verbally than to use his speaking device but we kind of have leveled off and it's not that we're not making progress it's just that it's not it's kind of a, just a super slow steady progress and Kadel is still at the point of single word request um, sometimes he'll have like two or three word exchanges but it's few and far between so we brought out the speaking device in hopes that we could make a little bit more progress at a little bit quicker pace because I just think he's so capable and he's so smart and I really, really, really want to see if Kato can get to the point to where he's speaking in sentences, like conversating. All right, so we've got all of our groceries inside. Let me take my shoes off. So the whole point is to increase Kato's communication. Um, you know, yes, he is verbal and he does have a lot of words, but the goal is to get him to communicate better and we've had such good luck with the speaking device in the past that we figured we would reintroduce that. So with the advice of, or the recommendation of his speech therapist, we went with Proloco, which is a reputable speaking app um, that you can download on, he has a tablet, so I just downloaded it. And so far so good. He definitely doesn't naturally gravitate towards it, but it's something that they're trying to introduce during ABA and speech. On a, I mean, on a daily basis, they use it for repetition. And there's a learning curve. Kiddo has pretty much figured out the app. I mean, he already knows it better than me. <laughs> but he just doesn't naturally go to use it. He, you know, it, it's, it's kind of easy for me and him to communicate because I know him so well and I understand all his words. But the thing is, is, you know, other people don't. And we're working on articulation as well. So we're working on verbal articulation and pronunciation. But, you know, the tablet would maybe be a nice backup for him so that if he can't get his point across and somebody's not understanding him, he can go use that. So we're just trying to introduce it, see how it goes. Um, Maybe he will prefer that and he will make more progress with that. I, we don't know till we try. So right now, like I said, we're just trying to introduce it naturally and get him, you know, use in the habit of using it and, um, you know, see what happens. See what comes out of it. All right. <laughs> okay, let's read this story. You ready? A bear, brown bear, what do you see? By Bill Martin Jr. and Eric Carl. Brown bear, brown bear, what do you see? What, what is that? Will you use your tablet and tell me what that is? Or your Prolo, I'm sorry. Home? Here, let's clear it. I'm going to go to home. Okay, what is that? What color is that? <laughs> Mountain two. Yes. I know, buddy. I want to go to Mountain two. Will you tell me what color that is? Where's the colors? We're gonna do first. It's what color is it? It is a bear. What what color is the bear? It's brown. It's a brown bear. Okay, so go back to the home page. Let's find the color. 
go to find the color brown. We're gonna go to color. So go to the color first. Bear. It is a bear. You're absolutely correct. Here, let me see your finger. We're gonna go home. Yeah. Oh, there's the colors. Okay, what color is the bear? Brown. It is brown. Okay, now find bear. No, 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 don't clear it. Go back to colors. Brown. Brown. Now find the bear. Bear. Awesome. Okay, now tell me what it is. Tell me what it is. Brown bear. It's a brown bear. Okay. I see a red bird looking at me. What's that? What is that? <laughs> what is that, buddy? Goofball, what is that? It's it, absolutely. It is a bird. Tweet, tweet. Turtle. All right, so clear it. But it's a. What color is the bird? What color is that bird? A hole. What color is the bird, buddy? Hey. <laughs> what color is the bird? Yes. Tweet, tweet. Hmm? Birds do say tweet, tweet. What color is this bird? Why red? Mm -mm. Red. It's a red bird. Red bird. Okay, so go on your Prolo and find red. We're going to find the color red. Red. Nice. Okay, now go find the bird. Go back to home. Go back to home. Home? Yeah. Uh huh. I see it. Where's the bird? Where's the bird? Yellow duck, yellow duck. What do you see? Quack, quack. Here, clear this top part. Okay, now find the color yellow. 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 Nice. Hold on, you gotta find the duck. Where's the animals at? You gotta go, <laughs> go home. You're doing so good. All right, where's the duck? Go to more. Uh huh. Duck. All right, now press the top and tell me. Yellow duck. Okay. Yellow duck, yellow duck. What do you see? Quack, quack. Yellow duck. I see a blue horse looking at me. Blue horse, blue horse. What do you see? <laughs> All right, what's that? Horse. It. I don't know. What is it? Horse. Blue, blue horse. Good blue job. Horse. All right, now tell me on your prolo. You gotta clear it out. Okay, tell me on your prolo. Blue horse. Blue horse. Horse. It is a horse. Will you put the blue in front of it? Horse. So go to home, find the colors. Blue. Nice. Ch tell me on your prolo. Blue horse. Blue horse. <laughs> I see a green frog looking at me. Uh oh. <laughs> Kiddo, oh my goodness gracious. Heavens to Betsy's. I'm so proud of you. You're so smart. Mountain. I love using Mountain. a prolo with you. Mountain. mountain. I wish we could go to the mountain. <laughs> Maybe for spring break we'll go to the mountain. You're so smart. I love your prolo. Ew. I love your prolo. Okay, so pretty much what you guys just saw was our exact speech therapy session a couple weeks ago. Um, school was out, so we went into the clinic for speech therapy. Typically, he gets speech in school, but this was a exception, and I got to go with him and see what they do in speech, which was really helpful for me. I love participating in his therapy whenever I get the opportunity. Um, cause it just gives me, you know, ideas, kind of pointers, tips and tricks, things that we can like practice at home together, which I love, um, because it, 
it really helps Kidel to progress more quickly when he's getting, you know, kind of con the consistency across the board. So anyways, I saw him doing this exact same thing in speech a couple weeks ago. So I decided to replicate it at home. And pretty much the thing with Kidel is he knows all of his colors. He knows all his shapes, all of his animals, all of his letters, numbers. He is, he's incredibly intelligent. And the majority of those things he's actually learned in ABA, um, just through repetition and um, like language goals, he's learned a lot of those academic things by practicing language goals in ABA and speech. But so the point of sitting down and going through the brown bear story on his Prolo speaking device, which Prolo is short for Pro Loco. The purpose of that is because, not that I'm trying to teach him his colors or his animals, because he already knows that. I'm trying to get him familiar with the speaking device because it's something new for him. It's not natural for him to use it. And we're trying to get to that point to where it is natural. He knows it's kind of a complex app. Not complex, but there's a ton of folders on there and you got to memorize, kind of like when you get a new phone. You know, you got to memorize where everything's at, which folder what is in and this and that. So just trying to get him familiar with the app and more proficient at it. So, and it helps me too because I don't know where half that stuff is. So I'm trying to learn it as well. And so, like I said, the, the purpose for doing what we did just now um, is more so for practice and repetition, just to learn the app, to get more comfortable and more proficient at using it so that it's more natural for him. And then we'll see, hopefully the we can progress with it and hopefully, you know, bigger and better things will come of it. You know, like I said, my goal for Kadel is that he can communicate and have a conversation back and forth, whether that's verbal, whether that's using his app, one half dozen to the other as long as he's able to effectively communicate and have a conversation with somebody you know because i mean that's just going to improve his quality of life really learning to enhance his communication get his points across express himself better um that's what i want for kato and like i said he does he's got a beautiful voice and he really has a huge vocabulary verbally and i'm so proud of him but I just want him to be able to take it to the next level. And like I said, it's not that we've plateaued. I wouldn't say that. We've just kind of haven't had, like we just haven't been able to take it to that next level verbally. You know what I mean? Um, so I just really want to take it to that next level for him. And we're just trying to provide him with all the resources possible. And it's up to him which one he wants to use. Um, if he wants to use a speaking device, great. If he wants to, you know, verbally use his words, great. So we'll see. Um, I do have all the faith in the world of Kadel. He's so smart. And I know, I know that one day he will be speaking sentences and he will be having a conversation with me. So <gasps> why does that make me tear up? Stop it. Stop it. Okay. Anyways, I know he's going to get to that level. <laughs> And I'm so proud of him, and I can't wait to experience that day with him. So thanks for watching. Love you guys. See you next vlog.